I don't think you can talk about the Stoughton Wrestling Program without using the word storied in front of it. It's the storied Stoughton Wrestling Program. Boy, they've done a lot of winning. We're going to talk more about that right now as we bring in Coach Bob Empey. And Coach, thanks for being here. Uh, let's talk about it. Hey, uh, D1 sectional meet yesterday for individuals. How did it go for you guys? Uh, we advanced 12 uh, individuals to the sectional meet at Oconomowoc yesterday, and we advanced seven uh, athletes to the state team tournament, uh, which are uh, Sorry, state individual meet at the Cole Center starting at 3 o'clock on Thursday. Wow, good stuff. So, again, I use the word storied. Storied is actually right here in my notes, okay? Let's let's run that down. You, you've been on here before. It's been a while, though, since we've been able to list off all the accomplishments of Stone Wrestling, but holy cow. It, it is pretty remarkable. I think the biggest thing when we do the numbers is uh, we hold the record for a school in any division for the most individual state champions. Um, with 51, our last ones being uh, Nicola Rivera and Hunter Lewis, uh, we have 156 state place winners. And then with the addition of the seven more, we have 280 state participants. It is mind-boggling. That's humbling just to say it. Every so. time you're here, the, the numbers grow, uh, so which I think is, is very cool, too, because it's it's not that it's something that happened 20, 30 years ago and you're living off of that. I mean, this is a current tradition that right. continues to right. build. And that's, is, a, that's yeah. the cool part about it. Very, very cool. Okay, state wrestling at the Cole Center, always a big deal, and that seems to be growing as well each and every year. Talk about the event, if you could, a little bit. Uh, yeah, up. it starts on th uh, Thursday uh, afternoon for Division One. It's uh, It starts at 3 o'clock. Wrestle our preliminary rounds in the state quarters, and then Thursday after uh, after we complete our session, Division two and three start with their preliminaries and quarterfinal matches as well. So busy event, uh, very busy at the Cole Center. Uh, the electricity in that place is outstanding. So. Yeah, it is always really good. If you've never been there, it's a cool event um, to actually go to just to feel the buzz um, that's going on in the Cole Center. Speaking of buzz, not only individually, you guys do it at the team level as well. Seventh straight year that you qualify for state for that. Uh, I mean, talk about that as, as a team, how you guys have been able to come together and continue to do uh, We have a great community, wrestling community. we got a great community uh, abroad that helps us uh, grow our program and give opportunities for you our athletes to continue to grow. And then obviously we need to have athletes and parents to really make it special. So the seventh trip uh, in a row is pretty humbling. 14 overall, uh, can't be more proud of where I'm from and the people we've been able to coach over the years. Absolutely, so individuals coming up this weekend, teams the weekend after that, right? Right, yeah. and that starts at 5.30 on Friday, um, March 6th. Uh, we get thing, things rolling there with the quarterfinals state team tournament for Division One, Division Two are um, on Saturday morning, starting on Saturday morning. So Excellent stuff. Hey, Coach, thank you so much. Hey, good luck. The rest thank of the you way. very much.